that all you got? <laughs> oh, hardly, my dear Ben Tennyson. I've got the Yeti's mind. <laughs> I, Dr. Animo, control the Yeti's every move. And I, Dr. Animo... Dude, stop saying your name. We know who you are. I, Dr. D have activated my devolution bomb, which shall turn anyone within the range of its blast into a Yeti! <laughs> <laughs> Seriously? That's your plan? Kind of reminds you of the old days, doesn't it? What, stupid plans? Guess so. Silence! You won't be so smug once you and everyone else in this hemisphere are all yetis. Wouldn't the plural be yet I? You know, like cacti? Octopi? Guys! <laughs> Storm! Shellfish on ice! Delicious! Ah, a battle of brain power, is it? I'm afraid you, sir, find yourself greatly outmatched. Get him. Yeti? they say in the vernacular, Sikkim. No! I am your master! Obey me! Heal, sit, stay! Ah! I'm still paying for that. Your assistance was greatly appreciated. Go now. You are free. <laughs> ah, but you've forgotten one thing. My bomb is still going to go off, and there's nothing you can... Yeah, taken care of. Attention, plumbers. Pick up in Sector 7G. Roger that, Gwen Tennyson. We're already on our way. But why are you guys even out there? All the real alien action is going on back in your own hometown, right in downtown Bellwood. scene of destruction here in downtown Bellwood, where what appears to be an alien creature has been going on a rampage. question on everyone's mind is, where is Ben Tennyson? Chinny chin chin. So you like a cool breeze, huh? Hey, chill. That's what they all say. Okay, 
So maybe you can hold your own against regular Big Jill. But I bet you're no match for her. <laughs> Ultimate Big Jill. <laughs> Don't you think it's kind of weird how this creature hasn't actually harmed anyone? Not weird, just lucky. Really? Even though it easily could have? It just demolished buildings, cars, inanimate objects? No one's that lucky. What? You think it's another baby alien? I am never changing a giant diaper again. Them's fighting words. Probably. I don't think it's talking to you. Hey, remember that dragon we fought who turned out to be an alien with a damaged translator? Yeah, good times, good times. Our plumber's badges work as universal translators. Maybe we should try them now. I swear, if it's another baby... I had no idea how to find you, old great Ben Tennyson. So I thought if I went on a rampage, the famous hero of Earth would eventually show up to stop me. And here you are. Happy? I... Have a phone number, you know. Thank God, wait, it worked. I don't have much time, Ben Tennyson. I need your help. Come on, people, move along. There's nothing to see here. Why do you need my help? You can obviously handle yourself pretty well in a fight, Mr. Galapagos. Violence is not the way of my people. Could have fooled me. I am not here of my own free will, but at least I was able to find the great Ben Tennyson, famed in song and story throughout the galaxy. Hear that, guys? There's a song about me. Why should we trust this Joker? Just because he's asking for help? Begging, if you prefer. I'm not proud. Let's hear it. I am from a peaceful planet called Aldabra, where, like the rest of my people, I ate grass all day and hovered above the ground, debating philosophy and enjoying the great gift of life. My kind lacks aggression. Fighting is not the way of my people. But in my short time on Earth, I've observed that your people fight constantly. Yeah? So how did you know how to fight so good just now? I learned it in prison. Told you he couldn't be trusted. <laughs> with the amazing ability to absorb matter and energy, much like your metal friend here. An Osmosian? Doubt it. Lying is not the way of my people. What do you want with me? Never seen anything like it. Do you think it can talk? <laughs> Told you by Valven. It's affecting him, too. Our abilities don't work in here, either. 
Andreas is strong. He can bust out of wall. No, you can't. Not as long as that thing suppressing our powers. Think! Well, I don't like to think. Bust out of where? What is this place? What does it look like, amphibian face? Call it what you want. Jail, prison, the big house. Give me a break, turtle boy. You've never heard of prison? Sorry. Where I come from, we don't have such a thing. Restricting another being's freedom? Unthinkable. My name's not Turtle Boy, or Amphibian Face, by the way. It's Galapagos. Andreas thinks Turtle Face is spy for Agrigor. Agrigor? Don't play dumb with us. You'd better not be lying. Lying? Don't tell me. You don't have lying where you come from, either. No. We have very pleasant weather, though. Why are we wasting our time with this loser? He cannot tell us anything about Agrigor. He's lucky he can walk erect. Agrigor is the alien who captured each of us from our home planets. To siphon our powers for himself, we presume. He absorbed my friend's abilities back home. But he seemed only able to use them at a much lesser strength. Hmm. Interesting. Why would Agrigor kidnap us at all? Why didn't he just drain us on the spot? Don't know. Not waiting around to find out. You're sure we can trust this new guy? Only as much as we can trust you, Rad. Out of my way, Pandor. I'm the leader here. You're not my leader. Wait for it. Our powers are back. You're welcome. I'm following that guy. Stay behind me. No, you stay behind me. This way. Just a prison. We're on a spaceship. New plan. We can't just make a run for it. There's nowhere to go out there, just the void of space. I say we come in view of this ship. Who is with me? Okay. Think about it, Andreas. Nobody knows we've escaped yet. We should keep our advantage as long as we can. Maybe we can send out a distress signal. We've got our powers back. Let us use them to take over. You mean we've got our powers back? You're still trapped inside that suit and can't really use yours. <laughs> now, who's with me? SOS, 
Any plumbers in the vicinity? Please respond. If you and your little friends are through with this pathetic exercise in futility, you may rejoin your fellow inmates back in your cell. Hailing unidentified star cruiser in sector 18404. This is Magister Pryor Galil of the Plumbers. We have received your distress call. Prepare to be boarded. As I said before, the distress call was a computer error. Everything's fine here. Then you won't mind if I have a look around? Of course not, Magister. Brilliant plan, Pandor. Like you did any better. If you hadn't alerted Agrigor to our escape, someone would have come to help us by now. We could have taken him out before if you'd all been there. Then what do we have here? We're saved. Told you my plan was better. This is a clear violation of code T22-. <laughs> to be next. Careful, Andreas. We're on a spaceship. You're not going to destroy us. If you wanted us dead, you'd have done it a long time ago. You're smarter than you look. After you absorb our powers, you're going to let us go, right? After I absorb your powers, there won't be anything left. Where's Turtle Face? Agrigor's got him. Move! This way to the bridge! Seriously, Andreas. Stop smashing open the ship. I like breathing. He's right behind me. In here! When Osmosians absorb the energy of other life forms, we only gain one-tenth of that creature's abilities. But I have a better way. I've built a machine back on my home planet that will allow me to absorb all of your powers. Now that this little diversion has ended, that is precisely where we are headed. Turtleface stole our powers? Turtleface neutralized your powers. I am going to steal them. Traitor! Once I have all your powers combined, nothing can stop me from attaining the ultimate prize. Except me. You promised to release me if I helped you capture the others. I lied. What a coincidence. I lied too. Everybody all right? Not for long. As soon as his sensors detect our position, Agrigor will be in pursuit. We've got to split up. Negative. 
We stay with the escape pod. It's our only way off this world. Suit yourself. May we meet again, in this life or a better one. And I haven't seen any of them since. That's the crash site in Florida where we found Bivalvin. He's still there? Nuh-uh. Plumbers took him off world. He tried to fix the escape pod, but there was a little trouble. A little? So we helped him get home. And now it's your turn. I am profoundly grateful to you. Just one more thing. Uncatalogued DNA detected. Unknown DNA sample acquired. Scan complete. Sweet. I can't thank you plumbers enough for taking me home. Who says you're going home?